This is the solo recital class for aged 10 years and under. The judges are Elizabeth Farnan, Georgie Mottram, and Rebecca Lawrence. The accompanist is Sean Frost. First is Ella Mae Turnbull, who will be singing The Dormouse Carol and Castle on a Cloud from Les Miserables. Next is Florence Taylor, who will be singing A Smuggler's Song, Zipper Dee Doodah, and Let's Go Fly a Kite from Mary Poppins. Next is Amelia Weber, who will be singing A Smuggler's Song, I Could Have Danced All Night, and The Water Is Wild. Next is Robin Livesey, who will be singing Where the Bees Sucks, The Wrangle Tangle Gypsies, and Maybe from Annie. Then Ruby Lamasria, who will be singing Where the Bee Sucks, The Dormouse Carol, and The Wrangle Tangle Gypsies. Next, Ben Ward, who will be singing The Smuggler's Song, and Wingalied. Next, Hamish Lamasria, who will be singing The Smuggler's Song and Close Every Door to Me from Joseph. Next, Ella Fairhurst, who will be singing Where the Bee Sucks and A Spoonful of Sugar. Next, Nandra Allen, who will be singing Cast on a Cloud and Pretty Polly Oliver. And finally, Rosie Morgan, who will be singing Early One Morning and The Dormouse Carol.
at midnight and hear a horse's feet. Don't go drawing back the blind or looking in the street. Them that ask no questions isn't told a lie. Watch the wall, my darling, while the gentlemen go by. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark. Braddy for the parson.
If you wake at midnight and hear a horse's feet, don't go drawing back the lines or looking in the street. Then that has no questions, isn't told a lie. Watch the wall by dawdling while the gentlemen go by. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark, brandy for the parson, backy for the clock. Gentlemen go by. Running round the woodlump, if your chance to find little rabbits roped and tied with full of brandy wine. Don't you shout to come and look, nor take him for your play. Put the brush with back again, and they'll be gone next day. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark, brandy for the parson. The gentlemen go by. If you do as you've been told, likely there's a chance you'll be given a dizzy all the way from France with a cap of Valenciennes and a velvet hose, a present from the gentlemen along with baking goods. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark, brandy. While the gentlemen go by, while the gentlemen go by. The water is white. I cannot get over, and neither have I wings to fly. Give me a boat that can carry. Both shall row, my love and I. A sheep there is, and she sails the sea. She's a
Gypsy stood at the castle gate. They sang so high, they sang so low. The lady sat in her chamber late. Her heart it melted away as snow. They sang so sweet, they sang so shrill that fast her tears began to flow, and she laid down her silken gown, her golden rings, and all her show. She plucked off her high-heeled shoes, a made of Spanish leather row. She would in the street with her bare, bare feet, all out in the wind and weather row. Oh, saddle to me my milk-white steed, and go and fetch me my pony, ho, oh, for I may ride and seek my bride, who's gone with the raggle-taggle gypsies, ho. Oh. oh, he rode high and he rode low, he rode through the wood and corpses too, until he came to an open field, and there he spied his a lady, ho. Oh. What makes you leave your house and land, your golden treasure for to go? What makes you leave your new-wedded lord to follow the raggle-taggle gypsies, oh? What care I for my house and land? What care I for my treasure, oh? What care I for my new-wedded lord? I'm off with the raggle-taggle gypsies, oh. Last night you slept on a goose-feathered bed With the sheet turned down so bravely, oh. Tonight you'll sleep in a cold open field Along with the raggle-taggle gypsies, oh. What care I for our goose-feathered bed With the sheet turned down so bravely, oh Tonight I'll sleep in a cold open field Along with the wrangle-tangle gypsies, oh Shall I live now under 
little shout or take them for a play. Put the brushwood back again and they'll be gone next day.
If you wake at midnight and hear a horse's feet, don't go drawing back the blind or looking in the street. Then they'll ask no questions, isn't told a lie. Watch the wall, my darling, while the gentlemen go by. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark, brandy for the parson, backy for the clerk. Gentlemen go by Running round the wood lump If you chance to find Little barrels roped and tied Or full of brandy wine Don't you shout to come and look Or take them for your play Put the brushwood back again And they'll be gone next day Five and twenty ponies Trotting through the dark Brandy for the parson Backy for the clock, laces for a lady, letters for a spy. Watch the wall, my darling, while the gentlemen go by. If you do as you've been told, likely there's a chance you'll be given a dainty doll all the way from France with a cap of Valenciennes and velvet. And from the gentlemen along are being good. Five and twenty ponies trotting through the dark. Brandy for the parson, backy for the clock. Then the loss of questions isn't told a lie. Watch the wall, my darling, while the gentlemen go by. While the Every door to me Hide all the world from me Borrow the windows And shut out the light Do what you want with me Hate me and laugh at me Darken my daytime And torture my night Just give me a number instead of my name. Forget all about me and let me decay. I do not matter, I'm only one person. Destroy me completely. Every door to me Keep 
Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Georgie Mottram and I'm here on behalf of the judges to give you the judges comments. Now as judges, we wrote so, so many wonderful things about each and every one of you that we would literally be here all day if I read absolutely everything out. So just note that this is very much giving you a picture of what all the judges thought and what we all agreed on. So firstly, what a fantastic category that was. We were so, so impressed as judges. You all brought something extremely special to the table and each and every one of you brought a stillness and a wonderful stage presence that actually is found in mature singers. So, so it requires a level of maturity that you all seem to have as under 10 years old. So it was just amazing to watch. Um, so really well done each and every one of you and thank you so much for taking part. So firstly, we had Ella May Turnbull. And I just want to say, before we talk about the singing, Ella, I absolutely loved your navy blue dress. Your presentation was spectacular, so really well done. You absolutely looked the part, which was fantastic. We all loved your performance of the Dormouse Carol. You really were a joy to watch on stage and you absolutely lit up as soon as you started singing, so really well done. Castle on a Cloud was wonderful. Your voice really suited the song and it was an excellent choice of repertoire. In fact, both choices really suited your voice, so well done for that, Ella. We also thought your facial expressions in both of your songs were particularly good. So huge well done, Ella, and thank you for taking part. Florence Taylor. You had such lovely intonation. You were so well in tune, which was fantastic. And you had clear diction throughout all of your choices. And we really heard every word, along with having plenty of facial expression, which was just brilliant to watch. You really told the story of the song and it was compelling to listen to, especially in Zippity Doodah. What 
fun you had. It was just wonderful to watch. Your smile and your fabulous eyes when they look up all really twinkly and it was just, it was just wonderful. We really enjoyed the actions as well. Let's go fly a kite. You seem to really be relaxed and very happy in that song, which meant as, as the judges watching, we got to just relax and just really enjoy it. So I want to say a huge well done, Florence, and thank you for taking part. Amelia Weber. So our third contestant. I mean, wow, Amelia, we were so impressed with your voice and your performance. We thought you were bright and sparkly and expressive. Charles said that it was one of the best performances of the Smuggler song that he has ever heard, which is a real compliment because he's heard a lot. So that was very, very lovely of Charles to say. The water is wide. Wow, I was really blown away in this song. Um, it was just so good. Your intonation was excellent and you stayed in tune that whole time through that a cappella piece. And I was even more impressed when the piano came in and you were just absolutely bang in tune, which is so difficult for a singer and especially a young singer, but you did it so well and with such grace and poise. So really well done, Amelia. We all loved I Could Have Danced All Night. It was such a good and detailed and mature acting choices that you brought to the table. Um, yeah, we just thought that one was absolutely wonderful and we all really enjoyed it. And again, just sat back and listened to your wonderful voice and watched your wonderful performance, feeling very at ease at judges because you seem so relaxed and so happy and completely in your comfort zone. So really, really well done. And thank you again, Amelia, for taking part. Our fourth contestant, was Robin Livesey. Well done, Robin, on a lovely, lovely performance. We were very impressed with your lovely top note in that first piece that was really excellent in Where the Bee Sucks. It was really beautiful and pure. And for the most part, the tuning in all your songs was really good, so well done. The Wrangle Tangle Gypsies, we loved the chest voice quality you brought to this song. What a rich and lovely chest voice you have, so that was fantastic. Really well done. There was a lovely flow in the phrases and some super articulation and great word painting. We absolutely loved Maybe from Annie. We could all tell you loved singing that one too. So again, like with the other couple of performances, we just got to sit back and just listen to your beautiful voice in that piece. So really, really well done, Robin, and thank you for taking part. Now our fifth contestant is Ruby Lemajuria. So you have to excuse me, Ruby, if I said your second name wrong. Um, so Ruby, we were so impressed with you. You are a naturally gifted singer and a natural born performer. Your voice is so rich and has such a wonderful depth to it. And your performance is full of musicality. So a huge well done to you. The Wrangle Tangle Gypsies, you have beautiful diction, we heard every word, and really impressive intonation throughout. Your tuning was particularly good. You stayed in tune the whole time as a singer that can be very difficult, and you did it with such grace and poise, so well done. You really do have a beautiful voice and a lovely tone, and a very, very pretty vibrato. Dormouse Carol, you have beautiful dynamics at the beginning and you created such a good atmosphere in this piece. Your facial expressions were very good throughout. A huge well done to you. You are a very promising young singer. So thank you very much, Ruby, for taking part. Our 10th candidate was Ben Ward. Thank you so very much, Ben. We all agreed you were doing tremendously well. And wow, what a beautifully pure voice you have with a really stunning vibrato. Um, so really well done. We absolutely loved those special moments in the piece where your eyes were up and you were really expressing the words and the music. So we definitely encourage you to, to make more of those moments and have even more moments where your eyes are up and you're really expressing the music because that was particularly special when you did that. So your pronunciation of vegan lead was absolutely brilliant. That German pronunciation is hard and you did it so well. It really, really was a spectacular performance. 
Your intonation in both your songs was brilliant as well. And we could really hear every single word you were saying because your diction was so good. Um, so very, very well done, Ben. You're doing so well and thank you so much for taking part. Our contestant number seven was Hamish Le Missouria. Again, Hamish, very sorry if I said your second name wrong. You made the story absolutely come alive in that first piece. It was very exciting and exhilarating and it had buckets of atmosphere. So well done to you. There were so many words in your pieces, especially the first piece, and each one was just as important as the other. So we loved it, well done. Close Every Door was very special. We can tell you are a born performer. It just pours out of you. You painted all the words, which was fantastic. And it really did come alive, that piece. We believed every single word you said. And that's an incredibly hard thing to achieve as a singer. So a huge well done, Hamish. Please keep singing, keep entertaining people. And thank you so much for taking part. Our contestant number eight is Ella Fairhurst. We loved, Ella, your beautiful high notes in Where the Bee Sucks. You had such good intonation. You were so well in tune, so well done. Your vibrato is particularly lovely. And you also had a beautiful choice of outfit, which I really appreciated. That was lovely. Spoon full of sugar, we heard every single word and could really, really tell that you meant everything you were saying. Your diction was particularly good in this song and we can tell you enjoyed singing because you just lit up when you sang this song and we really, really enjoyed your performance. So thank you so much, Ella. Narendra Elaine. So you had a lovely, pure and soft voice, which was perfect for this song, Castle on a Cloud. And your tuning was so good, well done. There was a tiny slip in words, but you picked right back up. And to be honest, that's, that's what being a singer is all about. We make a mistake and we just pick ourselves up and carry on really confidently. And usually the audience don't notice. Um, so that was really good and very impressive that you just carried on with confidence. So really well done. Your second choice of song, Pretty Polly, was lovely. And it showed us really lovely, accurate pitching. The song really suited you. It was a very still performance, which created a lovely stage presence, and you looked beautiful. Your choice of repertoire was really very, very good. Both songs suited you so well. It was a really well-rounded performance. So well done, and thank you again for taking part. Our final candidate is Rosie Morgan as our 11th candidate in this category. Part early one morning and the Dormouse's Carol were both excellent choices of repertoire. They both really, really suited you. We were so impressed with your singing, your diction, your intonation. It was a really, really delightful performance. And well done for getting through those long phrases in early one morning. You handled those phrases so well. So that was very impressive indeed. And there was lots of lovely expression throughout both pieces, really making that piece of music come alive. So really well done, Rosie, and thank you again for taking part. Next up, we had our solo recital, 10 years and under category, and there is a cup for the winner of this category. We would like to award the Certificates of Merit to two beautiful singers who gave very expressive performances. We would like to award the Certificates to Hamish Le Mazurier and Ruby Le Mazurier. Well done, Hamish and Ruby. The winner of this category gave a really special performance with an absolutely stunning voice. She is a very, very promising young singer. And The Water Is Wide was actually one of the best renditions I've ever heard of that song. So of course, our winner of this category is the beautiful Amelia Weber. Well done, Amelia.